The 100th meeting in the Tobacco Road rivalry between Duke and North Carolina, perhaps the biggest ever for the Blue Devils. David Cutcliffe's team, one win, and it's in the ACC title game. Early on, the Tar Heels creating opportunities. That offense, Marquise Williams scrambles to Eric Ebron. The tight end gets a block in midfield right there. He goes 79 yards, chased down at the 10. Ebron in this game would set a new single season ACC record for yards receiving by a tight end. From there, Williams keeps it for the score. He had over 100 yards rushing in the game. North Carolina takes the seven nothing lead. But the Blue Devils answer back their next drive. Anthony Boone over the middle, Jamison Crowder. 17-yard touchdown. He has over 1,000 yards receiving again this season. We are tied at seven. Second quarter. This season, on goal-to-go situations, Duke has scored a touchdown every time. But here, finally, for the first time all season, they get stopped. Boone stopped by Ethan Farmer. The Blue Devils settle for a field goal, 10-7. North Carolina has to punt. Jamison Crowder fumbles. And the Tar Heels recover. Big change of possession there for UNC. Can the Tar Heels turn it into points? The better question, are they giving it right back? The fumble into the end zone by TJ Logan. Duke recovers for a touchback, but they look at this one again. Watch Logan. He is down first before the ball comes loose. So North Carolina keeps it, scores, and now going for two, the fake. Tommy Hibbard to Thomas Moore, and if you're keeping track, that's the punter to the kicker for the two-point conversion. North Carolina takes the 15-10 lead, but on the kickoff, Devon Edwards, one of the most exciting freshmen in the country, and he goes 99 yards for the touchdown, his second of the year, the fourth kickoff return for a touchdown for Duke this season, and the Blue Devils get the lead back 17-15 at the half. Duke's defense making plays, Marquise Williams pass. Tip, picked by Kelby Brown, who's having a great year. He's second in the ACC in tackles. The linebacker comes up big there. Duke turns that into points. Third and goal at the seven. This is what happens when you give them a goal to go situation. That's a touchdown. Crowder tiptoes on the back line. He's in his second touchdown of the game. Oh, Duke fans are starting to think about tourist attractions in Charlotte, but here comes the Tar Heels right back. Williams to Quinshawn Davis, 23-yard score. In fact, the Tar Heels would add a field goal as well to take the 25-24 lead. Duke, five minutes to go. Boone to Jalay Duncan, 29 yards, first down. Duke gets it inside the 10. Fourth and six, Ross Martin, ooh, cuts it close, but it's good. The field goal, and Duke takes the 27-25 lead. UNC's last chance, 20 seconds left. Marquise Williams. Hit as he throws, and it's Devon Edwards. Makes the play, the interception seals it for Duke. Celebrating on the sideline, David Cutcliffe's team. Predicted, by the way, before the season to finish last in the Coastal, the Blue Devils are going to Charlotte, going to play in the ACC title game. A huge win over North Carolina in their rivalry, 27-25. This team was two and two. It has now won eight in a row. They are Coastal Division champs for the first time ever. Next up, hold on Blue Devil fans, it's Florida State. I'm Jeff Michelle with the ACC Digital Network.